barbecue and bluegrass, a wonderful combination. And Katie Duro and Dennis Kalock, they both join us with Kalick, join us with all the details. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. So first and foremost, let's talk about Stable Spirit and what okay. exactly that is. Stable Spirit, we are a nonprofit organization and we utilize horses to do mental, physical, and emotional health work with children and families. Mm -hmm. uh, everything from helping people find things within themselves to be able to do better in life as well as working with children who have disabilities. We have physical speech and occupational therapists who use our horses to do the physical speech and occupational therapy with the, with the children. Mm -hmm. Now, I understand that this is your first annual barbecue cook-off. You guys it have is. been around for a while though, so it was it a situation where you found, you know, we probably should start doing more fundraisers or was it just a new idea? Uh, we've been looking kind of for a signature fundraiser that we were wanting to do and basically our board of directors came up with the idea. They got together and decided mm -hmm. that uh, they had some connections with the barbecue cook-off world and mm -hmm. uh, the bluegrass uh, uh, bands and things and so together they said let's combine those two and try something together and see what we come up with so that's kind of how the idea came up yeah, it's it was from our board of directors we're just looking forward to those activities and to see what's going to happen absolutely so give me a little rundown of some of the activities that are going to be going on well of course the barbecue cook up like Katie mentioned and then we have the bluegrass bands and they'll be dancing and some silent auctions um, and then be able to bid on who you think the winning teams are going to be, uh, which makes a lot uh, like a nice reward for someone who wins. <laughs> right. And Simon Lightfoot with Tangleweed Productions mm -hmm. is who got all of our bluegrass bands together. Mm -hmm. So uh, he's helped us out in getting that together. A big and then, thank you to him. <laughs> yeah. And then Greg Sonier uh, is, is our barbecue cook-off person that's helping us organize that since it is our first year of learning how to do all this. Oh, right. And as Dennis said, silent auction, we have all kinds of items, everything from paintings and dinners and uh, baskets of various type things uh, right. as well. So come out and help us out with that. Now, so. talk to me a little bit about what the money goes towards. And also, have you found that because of the economy and the way things are, maybe that, that there's more of a need for fundraisers than maybe in the past? Well, for nonprofits, there's always a need for fundraisers. Yeah. Uh, you kind of just have to do that also to get your name out uh, yes, and let absolutely. people know who you are. Uh, we write a lot of grants and we get funding through them as well, but the funds that we're going to be garnering from this that are going to help us out is going to help to actually provide services, especially to those families who cannot afford mm -hmm. uh, to pay for those services. A lot of insurances do not pay for the hippotherapy and things of that sort, mm -hmm. and so we have to find scholarships and funding in order to keep this going for those children to get those services. All right, and so do you, uh, do you find like that people that that want to sign up is there is there more room for people to sign up right now? Or? There is. We can still take some more barbecue teams. They're more than welcome to uh, give us a call or sign up on our website. Uh, the information's there, uh, as well as we're also still looking for a few tasting judges for okay. a few of the activities. So if you want to be a tasting judge, get in touch with me as well. All right. Well, thank you both so much for joining us, and it's stable slash spirit.org for that is more correct. information.